hello, Shanti and Bounce Sugar Talk, and no, I'm not Tina Perkins, and Bounce Sugar Talk, you know right here, and, let's get this thing up to the top. Okay, so dealing with delusional disorder, like I'm actually really like a stupid guy, who has a delusional disorder. So that's kind of hard, you know. It's actually very, uh, it's very traumatic. It's, you know, some days, like today, it's like, when do they come and kill me? And I'd be the part right there. And y'all think I'm believing. You mm-hmm. end up there somewhere like, later. So, because he'll be abusive. And this time he's doing it because they reported something like that. I think the dude had AIDS or something, they let him outside or whatever. Um, they let him take a shot over before me and all this different stuff, trying to be evil, right? So he just tried to be saying, but the guy's cool, like the other guy's cool. It's just this guy, he just wants to keep repeating the stories and stuff that I already fucking know. So, you know what I'm saying? So, um, the saddest part about this is it's like actually <laughs> different symptoms of what happened. So, um, First one is erotomanic. So the person believes someone is in love with them and might try to contact that person. Often it's someone important famous. This can lead to stop the behavior. So that's what it is. So tonight he's just like, do you want me? And it's like, I don't talk to him at fucking all. Like, I don't, like, like for real, the only thing I want to tell him is to die. Like, I don't be joking. And so, um, I mean, I'm talking about this and I feel like I'm actually just wanting this nigga to die. So, um, that's it. Like, I don't have nothing else to say to him. Because when you got to a point of, like, doing that stuff and you were stalking, you, you see what I'm saying? You got a major problem. Um, grandiose. This person has an overinflated sense of worth, power, knowledge, or identity. They could believe they have a great talent or made uh, an important discovery. And that's what it is. It's like, he keeps, because he keeps moving. You see what I'm saying? People keep giving him, like, he got powers. And he ain't got shit. Like, he actually is a low-life bastard. Like, he don't have real skills or nothing. And y'all think I'm playing? Y'all can come see this motherfucker don't do nothing. I'm talking about not a goddamn thing. All he know how to do is avoid doing work. And so y'all actually think that I'm at a place where people are here to help. But no, we are in a place where these people actually just, they do nothing. Like, it's like... They actually avoid work, but they wake up to fuck with people. That's how I know that most of them are sociopaths. But in this situation, it's a delusional disorder. Jealous. A person with this type believes their spouse's sexual party is unfaithful. Um, persecutory. Someone who has this believes they are someone close to them or being mistreated or that someone is spying on them or planning to harm them. They might make repeated complaints to legal authorities. Uh, you have somatic. They believe they have a physical defect or medical problem. Mix. These people have two or more types of delusions listed above. And so that's what it is. It's like that's a delusional disorder. And it's like really important that some people really just get a gun and shoot themselves in their fucking head. Because I don't think people can get over that shit. I think those people end up in fucking jail. So just die. You see what I'm saying? Or get right. It don't matter. Anyway, um. Today is Man Crush Monday. I have not had a Man Crush in like a few days, a few weeks. But it goes back out to Chris Pearson, my son, and Jamie Foxx. I haven't checked on that shit in a long fucking time, y'all. For real, I'm tired. I gotta go to work and all that good shit. So anyway, that's all I'm saying. It's like, really be careful out there. And please come get me because I'm being held hostage with a delusional person that has a fucking disorder. And the lies just keep coming. They keep rolling. I'm glad that y'all found a way to fuck me up. You see what I'm saying? So, um, anyway, let me go. Thanks. Have a good day. Uh, to my enemies, just fuck off. Actually, don't even fuck off. Just kill yourself. I be really serious. Like, I don't be joking. Like, it's not a fucking joke for me. I'm serious. Just go ahead and die. And then that way, you don't have to be in no painful situation. Just go ahead and fucking die. Um, and then to my friends and family, thank you and I love you. See?
Thank you. 